M0 FXP, welcome back to my videos on the Radtel 880 g or the iRadio UV98. So we're on airband now, we've got my node and we've also got a repeater here. Someone asked me about the scope, so if I press down the one, it takes you into scope, okay? You see it there. Now, what someone said was, how do you change the sort of width here? Now, I'm just going to quickly show you how to put this. You can hear that working well. Airband. It's quite good. So what you do is to get it onto number one, you just go menu, green button, then down to key definition, down one, key definition, and then keep going down until you see number one. There it is there. Number one, it's a long press. Press OK and look, spectrum, just choose spectrum. There's lots more you can choose. And so that's answered that. So let's hold it down. There's two modes when you're in spectrum mode. You've got the one where you can hear and you do need to set the squelch. And you've got the one where it literally just scans it, but there's no audio. So if I hold down scanning mode, look, it's scanning, but you're not hearing anything, but you're seeing the peaks, yeah? Hold down the hash again, monitor mode. And then it's, it'll bounce back and forth between the signals. Now, squelch is quite crucial on this. Um, so with the at the moment, the highlighted part is the frequency we're on, okay? 133850, watch. 133850, and you can type in those frequencies. Then it's gonna span, now it says here, 0500K. So if I press the star, it goes to 500K. Now that can go quite high. Let's put in 2000K. And it's gonna completely change the span that you're you know, looking at. Or we could change that. Now you do need to put a naught in, so we go naught 100 k, and it's going to shorten the span as well. Let's turn it right down. So that's how you change the span here. The squelch, you have to press the, the star button. See, it's, it's moving you down. So star, you've gone down now to squelch, and if I put that to all the zeros, okay. Oops, I've just changed the mode. Did you see that? The flat line is changing the mode. FM, AM, and SSB. Mm, cool, don't forget, that's SSB using the first antenna as well. That's VHF, UHF. But we want AM, don't we? Because we're on the airband frequencies. And that's it then. Now, the squelch, I can see that. If I turn it up, it's stuck on that. So. Um, while it's highlighting the squelch, let's put in 0, 4, 0, that's still not enough, 0, 8, 0, still not enough. And let's just hold it down so it says, we want it to say monitor mode so we can hear. Yeah, monitor mode. Briefly stop there. Uh, we're on FM, let's get it on to AM. We're using the flat line for AM. See, the squelch is set a bit high. So again, star, get next to the squelch, zero, seven, zero. No, zero, six, zero. Now we need someone to actually talk. So give it a go. I've got my HF antenna in there. So this is what we call spectrum scan mode. That's your normal mode. If you're not used to this radio. VFO there now. Well, that's handy, isn't it? APRS coming in. Don't really know how, but anyway. It's coming in. So let's just go back. Let's go, I thought I turned APRS off on this. Pretty sure I did. Extended menu, APRS. Ah, off. Okay. Like so. Turn it back up. Let's put in uh, 145, 600. That's GB3WR. I'm going to press the bottom button, you go into HF radio. So now we start to use the middle antenna. 
Well, if you press the star, you go to channels that you have preset. See where that takes us. It's a bit of a changeover on it because it's using a different chip in the radio. 80 meters there. And we're just changing. Sorry about the delay. 20 meters. So, what mode are we in? Upper side band. I change the channel again. So when you press the star, this white arrow moves up and down. So that's where we change channels. If you actually press the star until it's next to the frequency, you can type. So you can go 07150. And we're on 40 meters now. You can go down one with the white star until the white arrow is next to it. That's your changing the step as we change the frequency. The bandwidth, that seems a bit, <laughs> that's better. I thought it sounded funny. Bandwidth, put it on three for now, and you've got AGC there as well. And that's your fine tune there. So we put it next to the frequency, we can start to, start to tune through. Doesn't look like there's a lot going on, does it? And then to come out of that sort of HF mode, which is using the middle antenna, it's receive only. Um, then we just press the bottom button. So the main thing was, hold down the spectrum. And then just scan through. And that's how it works. Bye for now. <laughs>